<laughs> was shared on Love in Dubai page yesterday. I don't approve this. I mean, I'm a Dubai kid, and if something is Dubai based and someone else is trying to, like, I don't know, take it, don't. So, London Salt is a rip off the UAE based salt restaurant. So, trending TikTok videos revealed a restaurant in London that is using salt's name, branding, menu, and same name, claiming to be the UAE based restaurant. As we know, the Sol story is incredible. It originated from a simple uh, Airstream trailer at Dubai Kite Beach with two women at its helm, Amal Al Mari and Deem Al Bassam, emphasizing fresh ingredients, amazing food, and community. So, guests, We're welcome this part of the family known as Salters. The restaurant belongs to the independent food company and has grown to generate over 1 billion dirhams in revenue and has 2,500 plus staff and over 30 branches. Like we said, it's incredible. The in, in, independent food company is a UAE-based hospitality company now known for cultivating distinctive homegrown food concepts, uh, which foster, as we said, community. The portfolio now includes Salt, Parker's, Somewhere, Pub, and grind and the independent group is dedicated to bringing people together through these amazing foodie experiences. So following of course people's recognition that London Salt is a rip off Salt's official account promptly shared on their profile on their official Instagram story a list of their branches which as expected did not include a London branch. Which by the way I am like don't try and come for Salt. Salt is like I, I I love it. Have you tried it? <laughs> have I tried it? <laughs> of course I've tried it. <laughs> if you haven't, by the way, if you're new to Dubai and you're thinking, where do I go to get the best burgers? Salt, pickle, high joint, end off. But <laughs> no, um, uh, no, there's so many more. We're so lucky to have such an incredible burger food scene in the city. Can I just say though, mm-hmm. it's so interesting to see it, but imitation is the best form of flattery. 10, 20 years ago, all that we, the food scene in Dubai was international chains with a, a big name anchored here. Mm-hmm. They never came here. Then we've grown such an incredible homegrown food scene that actually the fact that they're copying us shows how good the food is. And although it's annoying, it's like they've, they've stolen the name. And I actually, there is a burger joint I grew up with in Ireland. Um, and I always thought it was amazing. And when I went to America uh, in my 20s, I was like, The same concept, the same name, everything. Um, but we had literally just someone, some smart, opportunistic businessman had taken the name, taken the brand and just started in Ireland because he saw the incredible value that it would have. So that's what's happened here. I don't condone it, but it just shows that salt is clearly something to be in- imitated. I know. But I mean, like, look, look at the burger. I mean, okay, fine. I'm sure it's good. I'm sure it's yeah, fine. Yeah, it's not going to be the same. But it's never going to be the same because, like, there's like the Cheetos. Oh my God, the Cheetos burger. You know, no, Hisham, just don't. Don't it's never say be, that. No, 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 no. no. It's not going to be the same. The slider is too delicious. <laughs> no, no, it's it's not. It's. It, I mean, yeah. I mean, but you know, like that's the thing about salt. You know, like you get like two mini the sliders, cute, delicious, sliders, like, and the lotus uh, uh, desserts. Oh my god, I am dying right now. All I'm craving right now is a burger and, and a cooler. It's not the time because it is 8:53, which it means it is coffee time. Make.